discussion in November is going to be all about. Uh, that's why we need to all continue to work as hard as we have been for not only the president and the vice president, but for everyone on the Democratic ticket up and down the line. <laughs> Every conversation matters, and in fact, it's all the little things that make all the difference. Um, we believe in the political process, that elections matter, and that individuals can make a, a difference in the lives of individual people. And let me give you just one quick example of that. Many years ago, a, a unnamed freshman senator sponsored a piece of legislation called the Rehabilitation Act, which among other things, established the principle that people with disabilities are a minority who deserve basic civil rights uh, protections. That act, plus the ADA and the IDEA Act, which that same senator co-sponsored, made it possible for our son Ben to learn and live, who has Asperger's syndrome, to learn and live a fuller life. Ben not only graduated with his class at Winnicott at High School, he now attends Great Bay Community College, and Melanie and I are very proud to say that he's taken three courses and has two A's and one A minus. We are, we are proud that that freshman senator who had the courage to stand up for people like our son is with us today. Mr. Vice President, Ben would be here personally to thank you, but he's in class. <laughs> He did ask, however, that we um, that we say thanks on his behalf. So thank you. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my honor and privilege to introduce to you the 47th Vice President of the United States and a true friend of New Hampshire, Joe Biden.